Hi, this is Justin with King Swings, and we are so excited to introduce to you the Kingdom Series. Now, the Kingdom Series is made up of very large playhouses. Now, when I say very large, I mean very large. So behind me is an 8x9 tower with an 8x6 playhouse on top of it. But the Kingdom Series is the ultimate series if you're looking for a playhouse. They're flexible, you can attach all kinds of things to them, and there's just so much space. And on top of that, they're visually stunning. So what do you need to know when you start looking at the Kingdom Series? Well, first of all, we need level ground to install a cabin or a playhouse like these behind me. They're very large and they're very heavy, so we need the land to be as flat as possible. The second thing you need to know about the Kingdom Series is that the roofs are not 100% waterproof. So you don't wanna furnish these things out like a house. This is still considered a playhouse for outside. The third thing you need to know is how the cabin size is measured. So when we say an eight by six playhouse, we mean measuring from the outside of the playhouse. Because of the size and width of these playhouses, it, we can't go down really steep hills or we can't go up really steep hills. So we need a flat path that is open both of obstructions above you. So think like low hanging porches, low hanging branches, that sort of thing, and objects on both sides of us. So think of like AC units and that sort of thing. So we need at least eight foot, two inches wide, and I would say at least 12 feet high, clear path to get these things into place. So how do you get started? in this Kingdom series. Well, the place to start is deciding how big of a playhouse do you want. We have a range of sizes. Uh, we start at four by six and we go up to eight by eight. So the common sizes are four by six, six by six, eight by six, and eight by eight. Once you figure out what size of playhouse you want, then you gotta decide what size of tower you want to go on it. And mainly that is a discussion of how much balcony space you want on your tower. Now, taking a lot of our standard sets, we do a six by six playhouse on top of a six by eight tower, which gives you a two foot balcony. With these big playhouses, it's more fun to have a wider balcony. Basically, you need to figure out how big you want your playhouse to be, and then how much balcony space you want out the front of your playhouse. Once you figure that out, then you get on to the really fun part. So the next two things you need to pick is how tall do you want that tower to be and how tall do you want your walls to be? Now the standard playhouse walls are four foot tall, which with how big some of these playhouses can get, that peak of the roof is pretty tall. But if you got tall kids or if you wanna be up enjoying the play set with your children, then I would recommend doing five foot or six foot tall walls. The things to consider when picking a tower height is how old are the children? Because the taller the tower, the more impressive slides and the more impressive climbers you can put on it. Hopefully that's helpful. If you're getting a little bit confused about it, don't worry, give us a call, we'll help you out. Once you've got all that figured out, then it comes to the really fun part, which is picking your fun add-ons. So the rock wall is always popular. We can do taller staircases than we've ever done before. It really is up to you. So the important things to know about the Kingdom Series is with these poly walls, we can do cutouts pretty much wherever we want to on them. So we can attach almost every slide to the actual playhouse itself. So how do you go about ordering a Kingdom Series? Well, the first and most important thing is know your land really well. Make sure that it's actually flat. Make sure that you have space for what you're trying to put in there and just make sure that it's going to work. The second thing to do is to take some time and go through the various Kingdom Series sets that we have. So you get a good idea of what we offer what, and what can and cannot be done. And then third, start dreaming. Figure out what slides you want, figure out what climbing walls you want, figure out what all the different attachments you want. And then four, call in and work with us and we can make that dream come true.